All right, so this video is going to explain um, the reef die-offs that has been happening in the world's ocean, especially in the Australian Great Barrier Reef. So I read an article in the pop literature that came up on my newsfeed. It was disturbing. They went on and on and on using scientific terms and language for a mystery disease that's killing the reefs of the world. And they said that they have scientists working on trying to isolate a bacteria or a virus in the oceans that are causing right here, these reefs to die off. And I read the article and it was, it seemed to be written by someone very good. It could have been written by AI or somebody get, taking an amalgam of different sources and piecing together an article. Um, it's been known for quite some time in the fish biology world, the marine biology world, and the ecology and biology and colleges what's causing the world's oceans to die off it's the rising carbon dioxide levels so this tells me that they're blocking the articles in the mainstream news from qualified scientists and biologists we're talking scripps institute you know all of these biology and Marine bottles, maybe they're being defunded and um, not having their funding or their voices heard or something. Um, but it is well known why the reefs are dying off. Not, it's not a mystery. So here is the diagram of the reef and the biogeochemical cycling. And what happens is the sun evaporates this water into the atmosphere, okay, forming clouds. It rains. Since there's increased carbon dioxide, that carbon dioxide is going into the water, causing a pH, the change in pH and these animals here are feeling the effects. There's no mystery bacteria in the ocean or virus that are causing the reefs to die off. It's the pH from the rising carbon dioxide in the atmosphere that's killing the ocean.